Alrighty, how are you all going out there? So I wanted to introduce you to my latest simp. It's called a dub siren and it's sick. I love this scene. So um, it's made from a couple of 555 timers. There's an op amp in there, um, another module for the reverb and a bunch of controllers I'll go through. So this one's a, a modulation for the simp, for the um, siren so. This is for the waveform, uh, I'm pretty sure that's phase, frequency. This has got a, a reverb here. Um, echo, uh, tr tone, and some volume as well. Um, and these two buttons are momentary buttons. And it's really cool, a lot, a lot of fun, and um, I had an awesome time, I've been having an awesome time playing with it. So um, what's it do? Well, it makes, <laughs> it makes siren sounds, but you can control it. So um, I'll put it on. So you've got a momentary button you can use to stop the siren. Speed controller. And you can change the tone. And the, um, also the echo, so you can make it a, a longer echo. You can also have it as a, so it's always off. And you hit this momentary button. You can hear the modulation there. So that's the waveform of the modulation. Faith of frequency at the speed. So yeah, that's my baby. Um, I'm gonna, I'll put some music on, we'll play it to some music and you can hear what you can do just by messing about for it a bit. And I made this for a friend um, who's a DJ, but um, I'll give you a taste to That's it, that's all she wrote. This thing is freaking awesome. I love it, it's so much fun. Um, I loathe to give it away to my mate, but I kind of promised him, promised that I'll probably make another one at some stage. 
Um, yeah, if you want to make your own, check out the YouTube, uh, sorry, check out the Instructables link in the YouTube clip. Um, there I go through a step-by-step -step process on how to make one of these. Uh, it's not for the faint-hearted, but man, you won't regret it. So, um, yeah, keep on rocking and have fun. Bye.